engraved this ornament. This is MDF whiteboard. I'm going to show you how I wipe off to go baby wipe. And just wiping off all the residue from the engraving. And now what I'm gonna do is I'm going to, since I did the top part of the ornament, a shimmery gold. I wanna do these letters Right now they're black from the engrave or dark brown. I'm gonna take some paint. I think I picked this up at Michael's. It's the Plaid Folk Art Sign Shop. And this is, um, it's stencil paste and it's gold. So what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna put a couple dabs directly on the ornament. And I'm going to take a paintbrush and I'm going to push the color into all of the letters. And so once it's in all the grooves in one direction, Then I'm gonna flip the ornament around and I'm gonna push it in. So basically I'm gonna do this like in four directions to make sure all the paint gets into all the letters. It is engraved, so it's a very, well, I wouldn't say it's a light engrave, um, but it's not super deep. this set for a couple of minutes and then we're gonna wipe it off okay so a couple of minutes have passed and now I'm just gonna go and wipe all this excess paint off instead of it being black we have the gold letters and I'm just gonna take wipe up here and then I'm going to take a dry part and we're cleaning up the, the streaks I have 3M backing on this so I'm going to use this tool that has this little tip on it it's a sharp tip Go ahead and just start pulling away this 3M. Once I get it all off of here, it's just going to allow me to put this on my ornament directly without any having to apply any liquid glue to prevent any liquid spilling over onto my finished project. So now with this, Make sure to line it up straight so I'm going to stand it up with 3M it's kind of unforgiving so I want to make sure it's centered and straight There's that. And now I'm going to take this off of the little O. Probably should have used my little tool, little tweezers. So much easier to use this little pick. And then with this. Too big. All right, I want to get this centered. That 
that's where it's gonna have to be. Then what I do is I apply pressure to all of this to make sure everything is adhered real good. So I'm just gonna put this on top of here and then I'm gonna put some clips all the way around to hold it to apply the pressure. Thank you for watching.